please consider becoming a patron of the Ramen Raider. Patrons receive special benefits like bonus videos, voting on the Patrons' Choice Top 10, and early Top 10 list access. Visit patreon.com slash the Ramen Raider and become a patron today. Thank you. This is Hans, and it's time for another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time, the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And today I've got something from Malaysia. This is Red Chef's Green Tom Yum Soup Noodle. New formulation! <clears throat> yeah, this is like new flavor. It's, uh, it's different. I'll give it that. We will find out if it tastes different. I'm guessing it does. And in it goes for three minutes. So how's everybody's day? <clears throat> I am beat. We, uh went shopping last night because we were out of everything and it's a weekday and went to Costco went to the Walmart market Costco was pretty mellow Walmart market was insane mainly at the checkout so I get these bang energy drinks right they're in like like tall boy beer can sized cans anyways when I was grabbing them off the shelf, there was one that I was like, eh, I don't want that one. It felt, like, squishy. Um, and then I'm loading them on, I'm setting them down, and, like, the second one I put on the conveyor belt, busts the leak, it's all... Pfft. Like, oh, man. And, uh... The checkout lady just, like, flips out. She's like... Oh, why did you build that? Man? I'm like, lady, I set it down and it busted. And all these other ones I'm setting down, I don't want any of them because I don't want them to blow up in our car. So if you can, those you guys should probably just like throw them away. And literally for the next, it took her about eight to ten minutes to bag everything up. She was muttering and mumbling angrily. Oh, they've got they've got reusable bags. She, she was like really ticked off at us and more than happy to let that be known but and I know somebody's gonna go you should really report that to the company about no I'm gonna leave it there <laughs> it's all good but yeah I guess when you're going for low prices you really shouldn't be looking all that hard for a super super customer service but this is the first video I'm wearing my red chef hat I've never worn a hat like this before well I did in the unboxing video but yeah kind of a weird thing and Another dark, rainy day. A little bit breezy. I mean, come on. A lot. So I'm ready for some sunshine. We had some yesterday, but it was just like blinding sideways uh, winter sunlight. That doesn't help. But what helps is... Two, one. What's gonna be rad here is the fact that these have been on top 10. At least the original recipe. This is a new recipe. So we shall see how they do. So it comes with two sachets. This is a, I think this is a seasoning sachet. I don't know if it's a seasoning or if it's a uh, non-dairy creamer. Yeah, it's seasoning. That's what I thought. So let's drop that in. 
Yeah, it's not white curry. They don't put non-dairy creamer in everything, but it's the same style sachet. Just out of curiosity, I wonder how that tastes without the, the stuff. Because there's a large paste sachet too. I'm just curious. Very thin. Okay. So it's like a really light tom yum. Honestly, I really like that. That's pretty good. And then here is the paste. It is green. This is a color of green that it's really... It seems like cameras will either more often than not, at least in my experience, they'll show the colors on these as more of a brownish. I don't know how this one's showing up. Whew! Smells spicy though, that's for sure. Alright. Give that a stir. There is the green Tom Yum. Smelling green chilies. Wow. Alright. Give this stuff a try. New formulation. That's good. Very strong. I feel like I'm getting more of a maybe more of a prawny kind of hit than I than I did the previous recipe. Brawny and prawny. I'm gonna throw some mung bean sprouts in here. Stir those in, let them kinda maybe sit for a second so they kinda soften up. Wilt as it were. Yeah, this is yum. They have this stuff. Uh, if you're looking at the post, there's an Amazon link, but you can also get it at 99 Ranch. At least ours you can get it at. And it's pretty cheap, and it's definitely a good deal. So there's that. You see it? You can see it. Um, what else was I gonna throw in here? A fish ball. Nice big fish and shrimp ball. Mmm. Yeah, I could scarf down this whole bowl in like five seconds right now. I'm starving. That smells and tastes and yeah, this is good stuff. Indeed. Okay. I have some and I want to try a different color added into it. Here's some chili flake. And I think honestly that looks pretty nice. Um, let me do a little bit of cleanup right here.
this bowl actually came from Red Chef. It's one of the bowls they use to take the pictures that are on the side of the package, which is pretty cool. Alright, let's get down and into that. Yeah, I still love this stuff. This is... Is it is it better? Is it worse? I'm gonna say... I don't know. Could be better. I mean, no, I'm not saying it could be better. It's, like, really good. I like it. It's been on the top ten before. So let's, yeah. Rotate. All right, if you have absolutely any way you can possibly get this stuff, I highly recommend it. You can see me, my head getting cut off. Yeah. If there's any way you can possibly get this stuff, do it, because this stuff is really good. Uh, the noodles are always nice and plump. This broth is really flavorful, so you, you need this. You need it. You need it. It's been Hans Rominator wishing you enjoyment of all your noodles all day long and everything. Have a good one and bye.